Time right now for today's Bright Spot. You know, we caught the backstory of this viral video of the musician here who was playing for the whales at Mystic Aquarium. This is so cool, and that's why it's being shared hundreds of thousands of times on social media and really putting this gem of a place on the maps for those who have never been to Connecticut. Channel 3's Nicole Nalepa spoke with the man behind the music. They know that the whales love enrichment. They know that they love music, and so, uh, it's a really natural fit for them to just bring musicians in to have them play. <laughs> this video was taken a few weeks back at Mystic Aquarium. Musician Kevin Lothar, who goes by the name Big Lux, treated the belugas Juno, Keela, and Natasha to a private performance. I tell people when I'm when I'm performing, I try to create, you know, a magic moment for the crowd, um, however that happens, you know, and this, I didn't even have to work to make that magic more, because the, the whole thing was just, it just felt electric. An electric experience that matches up with this hip hop violinist's electric energy. You have a beat behind it, you can take, you know, an Irish jig and make it hip hop, or you can take a rock song and make it hip hop, or you can take a classical song or a folk song or a country song. A native of Rhode Island, Kevin picked up the violin when he was seven years old, but it was in Korea where he got his professional start and his stage name. In the army, I was stationed in Korea, oh, wow. and uh, just Korea, like they say, Lux for everything. So they took out the uh, the Luther, and they just called me Big Lux. After serving his country for 13 years in the army, Big Lux returned to the ocean state and realized he could make a living off of his talent. Now when I'm on the stage, it's 100% me. Even when that stage is in front of a pod of belugas. And they kind of roped off the area around the, the whale enclosure and basically just had me play for about 30 minutes for for the whales and stuff and so we were just trying different things out seeing what kind of music they liked and what music they didn't like <laughs> Hit her straight in the face, and I was like, "Oh man!" After that, I was like, I was kind of backing away a little bit. I was like, "Man, don't be, don't do me like that. <laughs> don't do me like that." I got this violin. And when all was said and done, it was a classic jig, which elicited this magical moment seen around the world. It was absolutely surreal. Just like something, there's something different about being able to like just like look deep into some of these animals' eyes. As they're like, as they're just focused on you, and uh, yeah, you you feel like you have some kind of some kind of really intimate connection with them. It was also a whale of a tale 50 plus onlookers were lucky to witness. A lot of people got to see the magic real time. So I think that, that combination of things made it amazing. With today's Bright Spot, I'm Nicole Nalepa, 